Okay, so what are we talking about today? We are talking about the imminent arrival of Father Son Super Saiyan 2 Gohan in Ultra Rarity. But before we get into that, I'll just say for the last two hours, I was just sitting there on Spotify, just like chilling, just listening to music, slow jams, you know. And you know what? It makes a person feel so much better, you know, because all the crap that goes on around, doesn't matter where, it's just nice to just relax for even a few minutes. It helps. But yeah, anyway, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. Now, I'm going to give you guys a banner, what I think the banner should be. Now, also, I'm going to give you a kind of a prediction of what I think they might make the banner. But let me know, would you summon on this banner if Ultra... Super Saiyan 2 Gohan was to release in about a week's time, all right? So, I'm thinking they are gonna probably put the old Super Saiyan 2 Gohan on there from the Soul Saga. They're gonna probably put Aleph Goten on there, which is gonna be a disappointment, and they're probably gonna put Trunks on there. Trunks may be a long shot, but if these three are on there, then I'm sorry, then this is gonna be just following the trend of Ultra Banners being terrible value, but... Just to give you guys an idea of how the ultra banners are, they're all linked, right? So, for example, let's say Janemba, you look at his tags, all the Legends Limiteds on their banner match those tags. So, in Janemba's case, it is regen, powerful opponent, and movies. Now, I believe he's got Broly, which is movies, Kid Buu, uh, uh, I forgot who else is on his banner now. Piccolo, Piccolo would be regen, Kid Buu would be... Powerful opponent. I forgot to do the last unities. I think it's Merza Masu. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah. That's just the idea that I'm giving you. Vegito's obviously a fusion and whatever tags they have. UI Omen had Uni Rip and God Key. So going on that front, you look at Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. You think, okay, Son Family, Hybrids, Soul Saga. Now for me, again, the guaranteed one, in my opinion, is Sal, the newer Sal, like the good Sal. I think that's definitely going to be 100% on the banner. I think that's a very good, good sign. So he would be on there. A long shot would be Namek Goku. Now the newer one, not the old Zenkai one. The reason I say that is because he did return already on the Bardock Goku banner and it would make sense for him to come back again on an Ultra banner. I do hope they don't put the old one on there, but the new one would be very good value because a lot of people didn't manage to get him and really want him because he's actually a very fun unit to use. So that would be a big dubs right there. Now in terms of hybrids, I think this is going to be the first appearance of Beast Gohan. Not the red one, the blue one, the old one from two year, from what, a year and a half ago? I think he will make an appearance and I think that's actually still decent because he doesn't have a plat yet. He gets a plat, then he's going to be up there, not necessarily top 5, top 7, but he's going to be up there again because he's still very usable to this day. So that would be a good shout for hybrids. And then you kind of think, what could the fourth Aleph be? It could literally be anybody. I think they would put a Goten on there just to troll everyone and then everyone just pulls Goten's left, right and center. Hopefully that's not the case, but yeah, that would be my format what I think Ultra Super Saiyan 2 Gohan's Ultra Banner should look like. So again, just to give you a recap, the new Perfect Cell, the new Namek Goku, Beast Gohan, the old one, and then a filler, which again, in this case, is probably going to be Goten. Hopefully, maybe they decide to be nice and throw in like the old Gohan, like the old Father Sanka Memeha Gohan. They, I, would, I would take that over Goten any day of the week, but yeah. That's my shout for this banner. Let me know would you summon on this banner. Let me know your thoughts. What do you predict the banner could be? If you don't think Ultra FSK is going to drop, who do you think will be the Ultra or Next Legends Limited for this campaign? I highly doubt it's going to be a Legends Limited, let's be honest. But yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments. And again, feel free to drop a like in the video. I'd appreciate it very much. I'll see you guys in the next video. Enjoy the rest of your day and see!